Hi guys, welcome to this session on Microsoft. What I want to talk about in this session is how you can use Microsoft Office Online for free without having to have a subscription. So this is what you do. First of all, I need to open a window in Cognito. So new Cognito window in Google Chrome. And then on the title bar, type in office.com. This is the one I want. And it gives you two options there, sign in or get office. If you click on get office, which is the obvious one to click on, you would end up going for a paid subscription. But if you click sign in, it will ask you for your credentials. So I've created a, a made up account here. So I can just show you this. .co.uk, I think it is. Okay, it's .com. Ask you for your password. And then you sign in. And then it comes up with all the apps, the online apps for Microsoft Office, including more than what you would normally get with a paid subscription. You get all these other things like forms, flow, people, contacts, to-do lists, sway, interactive presentations, Skype, business, and then the normal ones, PowerPoint, Word, Excel, and OneDrive. Now, if I just go back to this screen, so these are the online versions. If I click into Word just to show you what it looks like, you don't get the full functionality of Word, but you get quite a close match to it. And if you use Word Online, you, you don't have to pay for anything. So th this is Word Online. If I just drop the arrow down there, you can see there's quite a lot of information there. Not everything is there that you would expect to see if you use Word all the time. Um, one of the things that um, this references tab is quite limited into what you can see. Review tab looks pretty similar. And the view tab, again, normally you would have this coming all the way across the page. So there is some there is some limitations, but it's still Microsoft Word and you can type away and use it and save it and print it in the normal way as you would expect to do with a paid version. Now you will have the option, this popping up all the time, to go premium. This is where you are at it is asking you to pay for the subscription. So if you wanted this onto your computer, you would have to do that and pay for it. And then you would be getting a license for Office. Now if I just go back to all the apps and just click into Excel. Now Microsoft um, are adding new features to this online version all the time. So a new feature that's just coming to the Excel app, online app, is the pivot tables feature. So I click insert there, you've got pivot tables. You can see all the charts that you would normally expect to see um, in there. And this looks pretty similar to the full version of Excel. If I just collapse this button down, so normally you can see it like this. And it's a case of um, expanding the thing so you can actually see what you want to see. Um, usually because online you're looking through maybe a phone or something like that. You don't want this to take up all your screen space. So either double click in there. You see formulas is quite limited there insert graphs and charts and things like that are quite are quite easy. If I just go back onto that one, uh, this gives you a link to all the other apps that you can see there. Now you can also download an app, the Office app, which will then bring you straight into this. Again, you can work online with it. But the, the downside to this, I suppose, is that you do have to work online. If you haven't got an internet connection, you're not going to get into this at all. But all I did there was create a free account, a Microsoft account, so I could log in and get onto this screen. So I think this is a great feature because a lot of my um, relatives have been told by schools that they need to buy Office to be able to do this sort of thing. And that's not the case. They can use it online and get all as, as much functionality as they probably need for schoolwork. So that's the end of this little session. I hope it's been of use to you and I will see you on the next one. Thank you for your time.